Yeah. He unfortunately has been handicapped by sitting with the people that have not been that fun all evening. Oh, but yeah. He's not he's associated with them, everybody. It was no, just a we seat. don't know him. He's new to this stage. Give him all the key no, ones. We're going Respect to hell. Respect that the back row didn't give any other comedian that got on this stage. Oh. Give it up for David. I don't know. I'm a man. Oh shit. Right. Yeah, good start. Right. I'll let you guys know before I start. I'm pretty drunk. <laughs> oh, I wish I was. Coming out to a reels that's kind of drunk. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of pressure performing in front of your mom. Those sweet angels. <laughs> <laughs> Very hard, but I'll do my best. I'll do my best. Um, any Bible goers in the audience? I heard earlier people were doing bits about you know Jesus Christ and yeah, you know, fuck that. The book that he wrote, or maybe you know, somebody else wrote it. You know, you know what I'm saying? Oh, God, God, uh, there's this, there's this verse out there. There's this verse from the Bible that I've been reading pretty recently. I'm, I'm not, I'm not a Christian. I was baptized a Catholic when I was younger, but I'm not, I'm not a Bible goer. Well, but it's mistake. resonated with me, and I think it's kind of funny a little bit. Uh, it's John 7, 8, or 8, 7, something like that. Yeah. No Bible goers, so I can, I can uh, butcher this if that's okay. Um, the front yeah. girls. John 8, 7. Uh, the Bible verse goes something like, uh, Jesus was around some of his followers, and they were looking at this uh, prostitute, and they were saying, hey, this girl's a prostitute. We should throw stones at her. And Jesus said, no, 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 no. Don't throw stones at her unless you've, ca unless you've had a sin. You can't throw stones at her. You know, if you've had sin, then you, can, you, know, you can't throw stones. It sounds to me a little bit like Jesus was saying this because he was trying to kind of get with that prostitute. Yeah. Like, no? Yeah. If you were saying, hey, don't throw stones at this girl, you know, this just sounds like you know, you're trying to go with her a little bit. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> so, uh, something about me, uh, I like using Facebook Marketplace a lot, you know. It's a great place to find good deals, you know, Key West Facebook Marketplace. Check and out. prostitutes. A lot of crazy stuff on Facebook Marketplace down in Key West. You can get a prostitute cheap there. Yeah, you can find a lot of cheap things on Facebook Marketplace. That's the girls. Um, I was on Facebook Marketplace recently, or not recently, a few months ago, and uh, I was searching through, and every once in a while, they will have a recommended for you. A recommended for you, you know, we think you should buy this. I was on Facebook Marketplace, and I saw, hey, recommended to you. Song of the South. What? Uh, song of the South. Some of you grew up on that one. I might not know what that is. The song of the South was recommended to me as something to buy. The book? Introduced them to you. Yeah, wait, wait. Calm down, Mama. That's his grandmother. Ignore and that's her. how I know that my phone's been listening to me, that I recommended you to buy Song of the South. <laughs> Jesus. Needless to say, I bought two copies. <laughs> One to give away to a friend. Hey, Reverend, you already fucked up your own side. Don't fuck up your kids. Yes, sir. <laughs> Woo! We're not biologically oh. challenged yet. Smooth transition. Sorry. Uh, I, I mean, apologize, Dave. I've been thinking about this for a while, probably 10 years now. Um, this thought has been going through my mind. Did anybody in the audience know that semen... When it's ejaculated from the penis, it's kind of, hold on. So right, you need me for this. Did anybody know that semen, when it comes out of the penis, travels at up to speeds of 25 miles per hour? Yeah! This is true. You might not know. Maybe you've gotten blindsided in the first place. Maybe you'll find out later. One of you guys said you wanted to get laid tonight. You know, I'm just. You know, I'm just you know, <laughs> Don't beat the messenger, I'm just, you know, what you're saying. Um, you know, well, yeah. can travel up to 25 miles per hour when it leaves the penis. How did they find that out? <laughs> this is the question that I've been asking for up to 10 years. There's no punchline to this joke. There's not a single punchline. This is just a question I'm posing to the audience. How the fuck did they find that out? Was there a guy in a room somewhere fucking whacking off? <laughs> And then a dude at the other end of the room, like a fucking umpire with Get a her. speed gun, <laughs> crouched down the other side of the room with a fucking gaze on it. And as soon as he came, he fucking got 25 miles an hour. Just like that. But was there a dude 
fucking go into town on some chick and he pulls out, right before he pulled out, boom, right in the face. And the dude, you know, of course, he's right there up in the face. That felt like 25 miles per hour. All right, guys, it's going on. Thank you so much. David Ilefeld, everybody. He's going to hell, isn't he? Dude, if that's your first test, that was awesome. Yeah. yeah. That was bad. Yeah. Do you live in Key West or are you visiting? I'm a student. I go here. He, yeah. He's in college. 